Hi there guys, Joe DePet here with an app review for My Xbox Live. And it's an official app from Microsoft. Once you sign in, you'll see a spotlight page and it'll rotate between three different videos. And then you'll have this featured video up here. And then a spotlight gamer down here. And your avatar will be right here. And you can swipe it to the right and you'll be in social. This will display all your friends here. Like this one right here is a friend request. I can look at their profile here and pull it up. And then I can compare games and I can accept requests, decline requests. We go ahead and accept that. And it's going to update it. See, now that person's on my friends list. The first part is going to show your requests. And then scroll down, you're going to see a list of people that are online. And then further down, you're going to see offline people. Now, also, you can look at your own profile. It'll show your four previous games and your gamer score. Just like any other profile, you can actually go and edit your avatar too. Not everything's on here, but you can adjust stuff if you want to. <laughs> I had to see which I don't want to do that so let's exit out and you can start a new avatar so you can edit your style and also your features here color and all that and then if you scroll over to the right you're gonna see your recent games and you can actually browse your games and you'll see them tiled like this and once you click on a the game then it'll show all your achievements now also, and you can go in here and search and just say Halo, and it's going to show all the games in my game history that are Halo, and I can go to like Halo Wars, I can find out what I need, I can go over here and see, okay, I need to do this. And it's got the sound straight from Xbox Live, just like you're on the dashboard. It's got the same Zoom kind of layout that's on the new dashboard, so it'll be familiar. And also, something really cool they put on here is on your friends list, you can actually go over here and then add beacons. Now, in case you're not familiar with Beacons, it's a new feature on Xbox Live that's part of the new update. And basically what it does is you pick a game you want to play. When I click on Gears of War 3, it shows me my friends that played recently and how long ago they played. And you can click on Set Beacon. And you can actually share that or just set it. And I want to play this game with friends. Now when one of my friends gets on Gears of War 3 while I'm on Xbox Live, it does a little notification and tells me Frodo of the Shire is playing Gears of War 3. Or, you know, whoever. And you can also send messages. As of right now, you can't listen to the messages, unfortunately. Should be able to listen to those, but you know, maybe it's just a matter of time, hopefully. So you can go in here and you can send and you can delete and block and reply. And just be like, skizzle. There it goes. And you can change your online privacy settings here, which is very cool and convenient. Go in here and online status. I wanna be, no, friends, I wanna consume me, ha ha. And save it. So now only my friends can see when I'm online. It looks like it's bare bones, but uh, it's pretty cool for what it is right now. I look forward to updates on it. So I'm going to give this 4 out of 5 stars. It's a lot better than the one that's out there that came before that was unofficial. And thanks for watching, you guys. Y'all have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Skizzle!